I guess. And when my mother told me at thirteen. And when my mother told me he had died, I thought the world had come to an end because I truly wanted to marry him. And and so we get and we're watching and we're watching the scary movie The Lights Are Out. I was pretty naive. It was the early seventies. It's not like it is now. And he leans in, gives me a kiss, and it's the most disgusting thing. <laughs> And I shoved him away, and I got up, and I, I, my mother was probably, God, because I stayed up under the whole weekend. I thought, he is not doing that to me again. <laughs> and if that is what kissing is, I could care less if I ever do it again. It's not happening. The footnote, the footnote to my story is, when I was about 18, mother got a letter from his parents, and he had the connection. <laughs> so, I don't know, and he didn't know how to kiss good because uh, he was going to be a priest, or if my kids were going to be a priest. This is kind of what But Karen, now I've told mine. Army and Army is not the same as Air Force, and we all know that. So, uh, my father was killed in Vietnam when I was young. And we were living down in Columbus, Georgia in a 12 by 60. You know what that mm -hmm. is, right? Mm -hmm. 12 by 60. And it didn't even have a skirt on it. You know, it really was on cinder blocks, so you could load it in a hurry. <laughs> and um, my brother had a crush on this girl. And this girl had a brother. So my brother, who was older than me by many years, no, by three years, so he was about 15, I was about 12. And he thought if he could hook me up with her brother, then he could put the moves on that girl. So there's a world that tells you everything about the world except no kissing. Mom had medical books that told you how to have babies, but no kissing. Um, so